Stephanie Dobson joins us again here today on Primetime Local News. Stephanie is a lawyer and mediator in Lloyd Minster, and we've been doing a series talking about a number of aspects involving divorce and separation. Today, we're going to be speaking about a workbook that can be used to kind of help everybody weed through everything. So, Stephanie, welcome back. Thank you so much for speaking with us today. Thank you, Jano, as always. Well, Stephanie, let's talk about this Our Family in Two Homes workbook. Uh, I know we've had a bit of a discussion about it before, but can you really kind of get into what this is all about? Sure. So the workbook is about 40, 45 pages long. And um, so it's really divided into three parts. So um, it's, it's intended to, number one, is to create a foundation uh, for effective co-parenting. So building on things like learning how, what trust is all about and how to effectively communicate how to learn about each other's conflict styles and that sort of thing. So the stuff you don't really want to talk about, but at the end of the day, as professionals, we know that that really sets the foundation for effective co-parenting in two homes. The second part is truly a workbook. So there's tons of white space inside the workbook. It asks you the myriad of questions that I would otherwise be asking you in my office on, a, on an hourly rate basis. So the reason I like it is because it really allows you to do things at home that you would otherwise be asked the exact same questions in my office. And the third thing is, um, so if you see just in the top, I've got here SK, so it's province specific. So I've got three different workbooks actually for Alberta, Saskatchewan, and I also do work up in the Northwest Territories. And so the idea is to provide legal information, the legislation uh, for each province specifically. So instead of Dr. Google asking the questions, you would be looking in the to get information on things like how do I build a parenting plan, a parenting schedule, what does child support mean, spousal support, how does property division work specific to my province. So if there are families, Stephanie, that are working with you and are using this workbook, what is, what's the benefit for them if they go through this as they're working along with you? So really what I would say is it's about working on these things in the comfort of your own home you know, having a glass of wine or a cup of tea and really being able to consider some of these things. You know, you can take a week or two or a month and really think through some of the, um, some of the ideas that, and some of the questions that are in here because otherwise you feel like you're in a bit of a pressure cooker being asked to answer some of these questions in great detail without a lot of that forewarning. Now, Stephanie, also helps oh, sorry, go ahead. So just I want to make this point. It yes. also helps you because where, um, what kinds of things that you need to negotiate. And so, um, and, and so it really can help you to focus your conversations with your professional on the things that are really tricky for you and your co-parent, not just the things that you guys have already maybe worked out yourselves, but the things that are a little bit trickier. Now, as a lawyer and as a mediator, can this workbook be used kind of for both situations? Yeah, so I use the workbook in both uh, services when I'm acting as a lawyer or when I'm acting as a mediator. And really the difference is whether I'm providing one workbook or two. And so in mediation, of course, I'm providing a workbook to each family or to each, uh, each parent. And in, in my legal practice, I'm only providing it, of course, to my own client. And so, so it's really helpful on both accounts. Now, can families use this, Stephanie, if they want to do it like as a do-it-yourself option, or is it something where they pay for your services and then they get the workbook? So the workbook, that's a really good question, Stacey. So the workbook is intended to be partly do-it-yourself and partly work with me. So when you, uh, when you purchase the workbook, you're actually purchasing it as a package. I call it the resource package. So you've got either one or two workbooks, whether you're working in mediation or, or with me as a lawyer, plus three hours of my time. And so the idea is to use those three hours to help you to further the things that you can't figure out on your own. And so it's not at all intended to be do-it-yourself, though it's more do-it-yourself than what I'd call full service uh, legal or mediation services. Now, Stephanie, if people want more information on this workbook, what is the best way for them to get that? So uh, I've got this workbook, the information on the workbook, uh, on every page of our website, so henkadivorce.ca. Uh, you can also call our office, 780 875 
2234. Uh, this workbook forms the foundation of most of my work with most the work with most of my clients. And so when you call our office, whether it's our intake staff or at your initial consultation, you will be getting the information about this workbook. And I'll be helping you to determine whether it's an appropriate resource for you or not. Okay, well, thank you, Stephanie, for speaking with us again. And this pretty much wraps up our discussions for this year anyways, the year that was really kind of crazy for 2020. So uh, I just actually like to take this opportunity to wish you a happy new year. And I know we'll be talking again in, in the new year as well. So I'm mean, just show, uh, I'm gonna throw one more question at you. Uh, what are your, your plans heading into 2021 as far as dealing with clients and stuff? Everything kind of stays the same, is, is that the plan? Or you have anything spectacular in the works? Well, actually, interestingly, just last night I was I was sitting down by uh, sitting with a glass of wine by the fire, and I was actually just writing all of the different ideas that I had for development within 2021. And 2021 is really uh, kind about creating more efficiencies to be able to help lower cost to and to bring them more value for what they're what they're doing. You know, this is such a hard economic time. We're not through the thick of it yet. Uh, there's more hard times to come as we all probably are guessing with this pandemic. And the, the economic reality is that people don't save for divorce. And so um, my goal is always to help to create uh, efficiencies and effective resolutions so that uh, we can help to keep the cost down for families. All right, Stephanie. Well, thank you so much. And we wish you all the best in the new year. And we will speak to you again in 2021.